Man, I think they're. I, I don't have a favorite here. I think they're even. One mad. thing that Edwin needs to take it easy is on, don't stand up straight for the takedown the first minute. Here we yeah, go. See, the That's no the thing, you know. Yes. You need to be careful for that. That's the Ramos, man. He can't stand up That's like that. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. He's not there yet. Yes. On guard in the waist. Edwin, Edwin with that takedown so, defense, man. So, he's so wobbly and he's so hard he's so to keep calm. it down. It, it drives me crazy how calm and relaxed he is. He's it's like, crazy. man, that's Davi Ramos right there, man. You gotta, you gotta get sharp, you know. He's, he's got that non, such non-wrestler stance. It's just he stands tall. And he's so hard to keep him. Forward. Listen, Edwin is a stud. This yeah. guy is a stud, man. He's very talented, no doubt. I, I don't have a favorite here, bro. It's, it's hard to say. Um, it's really hard to say, but... Um, Ah, I'm just excited to see what's coming. Ten seconds to go for the one, one, one minute mark. You can see the bur the burst that Davi gave was big, and he and, he, and he, he, he some down. energy there. And exactly, I think he realized that N1 is going to be a lot harder to take down than he thought he was going to be. Right. Um, it was always one of those things where, like, oh, that was that's not going to be easy. So he's going to really be picking his shots and probably not going for many shots until maybe towards the end of the round. Uh, I think Najimi will wait till that one minute mark to be. Oh, just past the one minute mark, actually. He doesn't pull. I don't think anyone's going to be pulling. Nice. Whoa. That was unnecessary. That was a bit too much, but he's saying sorry. Edwin, is, his posture is showing really composed and very confident. <laughs> that's, that's the thing where Edwin really, uh, um, you know, that strikes me is that he's so relaxed and so confident. He's got this. The, the worst wrestling stance I've ever seen on a person. But at the same time, so it's, it's impossible down. to take him down. <laughs> exactly. Like, you know, a wrestling coach would be looking at that. Like, there's no way you can wrestle like that. But he seems, he, he does it. And David Ramos now is respected a little bit more because he doesn't want to give that burst anymore and, and waste energy, you know? It's three rounds, five. I think David will do it again throughout the round. He but will. he won't do it as all the time. I think he's going to really pick his shots from now on. Um, as confident as Edwin is there, I'd still be a little bit sharper on my defense. Did he really respect an Edwin, man? He is. Yeah, but he felt see, he's not, yeah, he he, he, he's he's not going to be as easy as he thought awkward. it was going to be. Yeah. It's going to be frustrating because when you have that sort of takedown ability that Davi Ramos has and you're that explosive and the guy is able to prevent that, it's got to have like a, a psychological effect on your, your confidence that you can take the guy down at will. He probably walked in there thinking there's no way I'm not going to be able to take this guy down. But, you know, Edwin is proven to be something else on his feet. Edwin is very slippery and his legs is very thin and it's very like a wet noodle put it out of the grip. he's like wet spaghetti exactly and it's really difficult to 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 keep get hold of his hips you know his upper body you can see the size of his shoulders much wider than the hips so that means it's just like a funnel put it out yeah. with all the respect Edwin <laughs> it's a good compliment I'm trying to give Ed is a very good friend of mine by the only, way. only compliments he has a here. unique style for sure. This kid, for the first year in the black belt, he already won the Pan Ams and he got in the finals of the World Championships. Did he lose to Lepre? Is that it? Last year? Yeah. Lepre, right? Exactly. Yeah. One minute and a half, Edwin showing some good counters and showing that he's there to fight anyone standing on the ground. I would be expecting him to be on the ground by now, on the, on the, by pulling guard at least. Minute left in the first round. Edwin standing on your left, Davi Ramos standing on your right. I gotta tell you, I'm really impressed with Edwin stands up, pushers, and control. Yeah. You know? Because yeah. Davi Ramos, he's a beast. You know what, man? Like I, 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 I was, I was expecting Davi to be able to hold him down that takedown. Like, oh, now he's got him. But I think he might have gone to the back a little too soon at the edge of the mats. Maybe had he held on to that body lock a little bit longer, let the referee bring him back to the center, and then take his time to go to the back. I think one of the biggest mistakes people make in jujitsu, bro, is that they get to the back, they see the light at the end of the tunnel, and they sprint. Exactly. Right? And then they, you know what? You got it. You made it all the way here, being technical and smart. Go. You got to continue oh, that. 
And you're right, uh, Robert. And you know that one thing that Edwin has in his advantage is he is dangerous throughout the whole process and he doesn't get tired. Remember Marshall Andre and Edwin? Marshall Andre yep. beat him. You know what? I'm, I'm coming to the conclusion the reason he doesn't get tired is look at this. He's, he's not really he's just so relaxed and he's a counter. He's a counter fighter. Right? Edwin has passed the first storm from Davi Ramos, which is a difficult task to do. And it's a deadly storm too, man. It's no joke. Davi has got to be, he might be the most explosive guy in jiu-jitsu now that I think about it. He is. He's just fast, right? So is Edwin, man. Like, I, I, really, I really think this match will end up in a submission at some point. One of them is going to make a mistake and someone's going to get caught. They just both have that style. Listen, Edwin is so confident on his stand. He has a scratch on the back from yeah, a big uh, one. Davi Ramos nails. Nice double. Oh, uh, no points yet. Remember, he's had his trap. Edwin's got to scramble. He's got to scramble. Two points. Good now job, Davi. See, like, I was kind of wondering why Davi didn't go for that double because his stance is so good. A single, I can see you doing a good job defending that single. A double with your hands connect around your waist, around your knees, is going to be so much harder to stop. Um, yeah, it was just. I, I think Davi was just waiting for the moment and, and, and pull off that double. What's funny, it was just like when you see Edwin after being taken out, the first thing that he does is fix his hair. That, that is incredible. <laughs> I didn't notice that. I will pay attention. He's more worried yeah. about his looks than his body. That's, that's typical uh, Najim style. Uh, You're left hand as a shield, and then you can attack more any other. Just your left hand is important for, for him to stay away. Yeah. Like Remember, Davi's still the very dangerous there, man. Like, any second now, he can leap for a leg lock, jump on that arm, jump on that neck. That's why Davi is so dangerous, because he's so well-rounded. Those are my favorite grapplers, by the way. The guys that can do everything. Well, right? so They're does complete. Edwin, like, like you said, yes. it, the same way that Davi is really dangerous at any time, so does Edwin. So that causes cautious of between both fighters. Nobody wants to explode or expose themselves for nothing. Yeah, but, um, you know what? I mean... Anything could happen here, but Edwin's definitely gonna have to turn it on. He knows he's behind. It's a good spin underneath. He's gonna be a thing nice. That could be it. That could be it. Yes. Saved by Edwin. Davi with the defense. Oh, oh. oh. This could be. Wow. That's crazy. Is he? Oh, it's a top. No way. Unbelievable. Edwin tops Davi Ramos on the back take with amazing setup of the takedown turn to the back. You can just see well, how see the replay. The V looks like he was not expecting it. Out of nowhere. Let's go! Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, winner by Mataleo, Edwin.